Hey guys, in this video I'll be talking about my blushes. If you remember, I made a video uh, that's showing my makeup collection and I um, got some requests that, requests that uh, some people want me to show my blushes. Um, so I will do that. Okay, the first one that I want to mention is a Inglot blush. And this is in Freedom Blush 26B1. It looks like this. It has some shimmer in it. And you can see that. And when I swatch it, it looks like this. It looks like this. And yes. Another blush that I want to show you is Maybelline's Rosewood blush from the Ephneton collection and you can tell that it's a and it's broken um, I made a video about the products that I won't purchase again so uh, this was one of them and if you want to swatch of it and my explanation about this blush you can go check that video out um, a new blush that I got recently is Wet n Wild's um, Heather Silk I bought this blush from um, chipsmiles.com because we don't have um, Wet n Wild here so it's a matte middle toned pink which looks like this on the hand and when you swatch it it's, it looks like this it's very very pigmented um, my camera doesn't catch the colors very well but it's really pigmented so you need to use a light hand with it I like that color. It stays pretty much on the skin too. Another um, blush that I got recently is Catherine Arley's blush in number 01 and it's a gorgeous gorgeous shimmery pink um, peachy pink. I love this blush. When I saw it the first time I fall in love. And the color is like this. It's pretty bright on the hand and on your skin today I'm wearing it if you can't tell it looks like this oh I love this color it's beautiful so this is my kit and early moving on to other blushes that I have one is from Carmina and shimmer tones 02 number 02 and it looks like this you can see many colors in it from the darkest to going to light and you can use this color as a highlighter for your cheekbones like I do looks like this and the uh, darker color looks like this so you can swirl your brush in it and apply it to your face I like this another favorite of mine is by Flormar and it's this number 91 a beautiful peachy pink shimmery it's not very shimmery the shimmer in it are very the shimmers in it are very fine mm, but it's not matte too it looks like this I love this color and on the skin it looks like this I really really like my products their powder products are never too powdery and you ne never have any fallout problems with eyeshadows and these colors stay on really good I love for another blush that I want to mention is by Newell it's a drugstore brand and um, I think they try to dupe hard candy packages I'm not sure but it looks like that and the color is this it's a matte um, berry undertoned pink and it looks gorgeous and on the hand it's like this and here is a swatch it's not very pigmented so you don't have the um, risk of looking like a clown when you wear it 
even though if you're not very careful with your blush and there are three blushes from the same brand it's Julian I don't know it's a if it's a only Turkey drugstore brand I hope it's not it's a 821 821 blush I love this color it's my go-to blush um, it doesn't show up very well so you can always layer it on um, I don't know if you can tell but it looks very very natural on the skin and I love this blush it's one of my favorites and now uh, it's here if you can tell what a what an ugly swatch I made sorry and another Julian blush is this baby pink one what a beautiful color it's matte again and the color is 20 matte baby pink looks good and on the skin it's pretty pigmented it shows up very well and looks like this so I like this too another Julian blush is number 23 and it's very pigmented it's one of the most pigmented blushes I've ever so I just barely touched it and you can tell how pigmented it is and yeah with only one swipe very pigmented and these blushes smell gorgeous and I have everyday minerals blushes that I made a separated video for them so I won't show the colors in this video I'm just gonna mention them as names if you want to see a detailed review go watch my other video it's in Turkish and English so find your language and watch it okay waffle cone a taupey brown with shimmer walkie talkie a blue undertoned pink with shimmer snuggle is amazing it's a peach pink with shimmer and looks perfect it's a um, mauve undertoned pink and matte summer stroll is a gorgeous gorgeous bright coral and well it's matte but it has kind of reflection in it so it doesn't have any shimmer but it's still not like matte on the skin email me a um, matte brown undertoned pink which is very very natural and new car smell is a um, orangey color with shimmer so um, moving on to cream blushes that I don't like I mean I like these colors but I don't like the cream blush thing so anyway I will show the first one is Max Factors Miracle Touch Cream Blush and my shade is Soft Pink and it looks like this and when you apply it it looks like this on the hand on the finger and on the hand it looks like this and you can tell that it's pretty um, glowy okay the second cream blush is elves all over color stick in pink lemonade and it looks like oh and it looks like this and on the hand when you swatch it it looks like this again I am not a big um, cream blush fan so I don't use that damn so much and the last blush that I want to show you is a high-end blush it's my only high-end blush and it's by NARS orgasm the famous orgasm it's a pink with um, goldish um, shimmer in it so when you apply it to your cheeks it looks like it has a um, peachy goldish undertone and of course it looks amazing 
it looks like this on the hand and if I can find a place to show the color to you guys Okay, on the hand it looks like this it's here and I'm a terrible swatcher I know so this is orgasm by NARS and yes these were my blushes if you have any questions please feel free to ask me thanks for watching and I will talk to you guys later bye